The country's president, Flix Tizekadi, has been sworn in for a second term in office following his re-election in highly disputed presidential polls. Now, during his inaugural speech, Tizekadi vows to unite the country, strengthen the economy and curb the increasing violence in the eastern part of the country. The country's opposition, who described the election as a slam, were planning to disrupt the inauguration but heavy security deployment dispelled their planned protests. Here's more details of that in this report. The ceremony was attended by several African heads of state at the 80,000-seat stadium. In his inaugural speech, President Felix Chisekedi promised to unite the country, improve the economy, and end the insecurity in the East. What is going to be his mandate, his priority, is to develop the countryside, so that the people are going to live in peace and security. And the secondly, the, uh, the war in east of the countries, this war is imposed by our multinational, as you know, because of minerals and so on. And the president wants these minerals to profit to Congolese people. Many Congolese were excited to witness the event. It is great joy to see our president swearing in for his second term. We saw presidents from other countries coming here to witness the ceremony. We ask God to protect our president and give him wisdom to lead the Congo. The DRC president took office following a disputed election which opposition figures described as a sham. The polls were marred by long delays, a voting extension and the illegal possession of voting machines by some politicians. The election results were challenged in court, but the judges dismissed the petition. Some opposition leaders urged their supporters to take to the streets to denounce the president's re-election. But a heavy police and military presence kept them at bay. The Electoral Commission declared President Chisekedi the winner of the December polls with 73% of the votes cast. His main challenger, Moise Katumbi, came in second with 18%, followed by Martin Fayulu with 5%. President Felix Chisekedi has taken his oath of office with a promise to unite the country and in security and improve the economic conditions of all Congolese citizens. He faces a huge task of transforming this country that has been politically unstable for almost three decades.